Good evening, everyone. We're just going to wait a moment or two until everybody can get signed on. Make yourself comfortable. Good to have lots of people with us today. I think everybody wants to travel. Me too. <laughs> I can't wait to get up. I can't wait. I, you know, I actually had to go and look for my passport a couple of days ago. I was like, do I still have it? Is it still here? Is it expired? <laughs> it's I been had to check mine so too. long since I've since so long since I've used it. <laughs> All right, if you're just going to give another 30 seconds. All right, good evening, everyone. You know, I'm looking outside and it's dark already. Um, so we definitely know that fall is coming. So welcome to Expedia Cruises to Thursday night travel talk. And tonight our special guest is Lindsay Sand from Air Canada Vacations. Everyone is muted. You do have control of your video. We'd love to see your faces. It's been too long since we've connected with people. So if you feel comfortable and it's okay if you're in your pajamas. Uh, there is into the chat and we will answer them after the presentation. So my name is Lisa Antwick. I'm one of the consultants at Expedia Cruises and tonight's travel talk is being hosted by the six Edmonton Expedia Cruises locations. We have been doing these travel talks for oh since basically April of last year and we do them every week to inspire you to educate you and to let you know what's happening in the travel industry. Unbelievably, we're coming up to 20 months that travel has shut down. And if you're on this call, I'm sure you love to travel. Travel fulfills us, that's why we do it. And if you're like me, you're missing it. Great news, travel has begun. And today, this afternoon, the government advisory lifted restrictions for, vac uh, for vaccinated travels, travelers. So it is now under the government that says, if you are vaccinated, it is safe to go. Resort vacation spots such as Mexico, Cuba, the Dominican, Jamaica are open for booking. Winter is coming. And even though our temperatures are a little bit mild, we can't be lulled into thinking that winter doesn't come because in Alberta, it does. And it's a great time to start planning of getting away from the cold and the snow and having our toes in the sand and on the beach. I will say that travel nowadays is a little bit more complex. Now more than ever, the advice of a travel consultant is needed. Our consultants are here to help you navigate the new complexities of travel and make sure your vacation is safe and seamless. We always think that we can do things on our own, but when it comes to travel, I think that we need to have the advice of an expert. What you will receive when you book with a travel agent is the following expertise. There are hundreds of different resorts, that, resorts and destinations, and your travel advisor can help you find the right trip for you. We'll be able to give you information regarding passport, visas, entry requirements, protocols for COVID, and also we'll be there to assist you in emergencies. If you are ready to travel, we are here to help. And if you are not feeling 100% comfortable in traveling, that's okay as well. But it is the right time to plan ahead. Studies have shown that approximately 40% of the pleasure of a trip comes from planning one. Last year has been challenging, and sometimes what gets me through it is thinking where I want to go next. And you might have heard the bucket list is now called the to-do list. I can't wait to start traveling again. Time has passed, and I have much to look forward to and make up for. Whatever your dreams are at Expedia Cruises, our consultants can help them come true. We are committed to finding you the best value for your travel dollars. We are more than just cruises. Our name, Expedia Cruises Air, Land, and Sea Vacations. When you come in, we can help you plan all the components of your vacation. And best of all, we are in your neighborhood so you can shop local. So now sit back and relax and let's start exploring the world and dreaming of your next vacation. I'd like to introduce our tonight's, our special guest. Welcome, Lindsay. Thank you so much for that amazing introduction and so nice to see everyone. Um, yeah, so my name is Lindsay Sand. I'm the Area Sales Manager for Air Canada Vacations. I'm based here in Alberta and I cover Alberta, Saskatchewan and Manitoba. And I just wanted to say, I'm really feeling Patricia's style. So take a note from Patricia, I, her drink of choice. <laughs> Good job. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and share my screen. 
So I have a short presentation for you guys today, and I'm so excited to, oh, there we go. I'm so excited to talk to you about my favorite thing, which is travel. Lisa, is my screen visible? Hopefully it is. Hopefully you can see my PowerPoint presentation. Um, now you are I, good. Thank you. <laughs> I asked you a question. I didn't even look to see if you were nodding or not. Forgot everyone was muted. Um, so we like to call our Expedia uh, Cruises travel agents ACV Dream Makers because I can just echo what Lisa was saying. Um, now more than ever, I mean, it was always important to book with a travel consultant, especially now because the world has changed for sure. Um, and just for quality, I was, I think I'm going to shut off my camera if that's okay with everyone. It's because I see it glitching a little bit. Okay. Then I can minimize. Perfect. So on the top of everyone's minds is our commitment to safer travel. We want to be traveling and we want to do it safely. And so I'm so happy to give this presentation on how Air Canada and Air Canada Vacations achieves that. So first things first, our health and safety protocols with Air Canada. If you haven't had a chance to fly yet with us um, over the last 20 months, um, I can tell you that not too much has changed. I mean, we've all become accustomed to uh, going to the grocery store and wearing our masks and sanitizing our hands and washing them. Or if we go to the doctor's office, they take our temperature before we step into the doctor's office. It's kind of the same thing when we travel now. So you can see all the red dots on my screen. Those are all the highly touched areas that are frequently sanitized for your safety. Um, as you can see, everyone's wearing a mask. So basically, as soon as you get into the airport, as soon as you step into the airport, you'll be wearing your mask almost until you get to your destination. Um, now we'll be taking your temperature, security does this. So that, with that being said, security is a little bit longer than we were used to in the past. So leave yourself some extra time in order to get through security on time and catch your flight. Now I have the opportunity to travel to uh, Toronto, so just domestically. Uh, but it was still great to be on a plane. So I can tell you from experience, I felt super safe. And regardless of class of service, whether you're in business or economy, um, everyone will get, if you can see my mouse here, everyone will get a Clean Care Plus kit um, included. So within that Clean Care Plus kit, there's a mask. So if you wanna change out the mask from the one that you're wearing, um, or if you wanna just keep it for later, you can do so. There's a couple of sanitizing wipes if you wanna wash off the tray table again, um, so a little bottle of hand sanitizer, um, and then, on um, the next slide, so once you get into destination, so you've traveled safely to Cancun, for example, um, and if you've traveled before with Air Canada Vacations, you might recognize uh, this icon here. These are our Air Canada Vacations destination reps, and so they welcome you when you get out of the airport. They'll be wearing their red t-shirts, kind of like the one I was uh, just wearing, if you remember that. Of course, their masks and their Air Canada Vacations sign. Okay. And then uh, pre-boarding. So before each transfer and after each overnight, I should mention here too, transfers are included with our Mexico and Caribbean products. So that's a, uh, it's a great bonus. Uh, so the vehicles themselves and all its high touch areas are cleaned and sanitized with alcohol-based disinfectant products. Um, of course, we've got to wear our masks on board the transfer bus as well. And we're still blocking off every other seat. So as you can see, there's a person here, then no one sitting behind them, and then the next person. This is to help maintain social distancing measures. Then once you arrive at the hotel or re resort that you choose, our representatives will continue to prioritize safety by wearing face coverings and other PPE items when handling your luggage. And then the resort or hotel that you're staying at will implement its own health and safety measures throughout the state. Um, so before we get into the fun stuff, I just wanted to highlight this amazing tool that we have. And, you know, all of the consultants are aware of this tool, and I think they use it on a daily basis. Um, so consumers, you guys can use this as well. It's just aircanada.com backslash travel ready. And it'll kind of help tell you where you can go and what restrictions there are. So as you can see here, it's a it's a super useful site. You can put in what passport you have. If it's not Canadian, they have other options. 
uh, vaccination status. Of course, that will be fully vaccinated now. Your departures, you can type in uh, YEG in probably your case and to Mexico. And then it'll populate all of the travel restrictions that are required in order to get into Mexico. And then if you click the return, it'll show you all the travel restrictions um, or any documents that you need to come back to Canada. So super useful tool. Let's get into the fun stuff. Let's say that you're ready to travel or ready to at least start thinking about travel. Um, our new Sun brochure has just come out. Uh, physical copies will be available in your Expedia offices, hopefully within the next month. Until then, we have a digital copy on Air Canada Vacations, or you can ask your consultant to send one to you. And inside the brochure, you'll see that we offer over 550 resorts just in Mexico and Caribbean alone. 35 of those are semi-exclusive, three exclusive, we also have uh, cruises and a number of collections to offer as well. And here's a fun map of where we can go. Edmonton, of course, somewhere around here. So fastest flights, Puerto Vallarta, Cancun, maybe Las Cabos via Vancouver. Lots of options to choose from. So this is another question that I get quite often. Where can I go? Um, that's a quick connection because you know, with all the changes that have been that that's been happening over the last year and a half, we haven't got anything direct from Edmonton. Um, so you'll have to connect via Calgary, you can connect via Winnipeg, Vancouver, or of course, uh, the bulk of all our flights are from Toronto and Montreal. So from Calgary this year, we've got Cancun and Puerto Vallarta from Winnipeg, Cancun, from Vancouver, we've got Cancun, Puerto Vallarta, Los Cabos, Extapa, and Mexico City. Now, another question that I get a lot, and it's probably on the top of your minds, is what, how do I get to these cities? Like, how much does it cost? Is it going to cost the amount of a regular plane ticket? Is it going to cost $500 return in order to get to Vancouver and back to make that connection? Absolutely not. So we have special contracts with Air Canada, of course, um, to offer that at a reduced cost for you. Now I've pulled some pricing from Edmonton. So say for example, you wanna go to Los Cabos uh, for a week long vacation, you can go Edmonton to Vancouver to Los Cabos, Los Cabos, Vancouver, Edmonton. And that cost for that extra connector is only $65. Um, now this does uh, depend on the class of service, but this is the lowest class of service in economy. So it's quite affordable um, in order to make that connection. One thing that I'm really passionate about, and I'll just quickly touch on this, uh, it's our leave less, do more environmental commitment um, at Air Canada and Air Canada Vacations. So we're committed to, and I'm not going to read all these out, don't worry, we're committed to less carbon. So we're committing to an ambitious goal of net zero greenhouse gas emissions through global operations by 2050, which is quite ambitious. We're reducing greenhouse gases through the modernization of Air Canada's fleet. We're using alternative energy sources to power the ground support equipment and the facilities. Less waste. We're continuously reviewing ways to reduce the amount of single-use plastics. I read a stat right before I jumped on here. We've reduced or we've saved 47 million pieces of single-use plastic from our aircrafts only since 2019, which is great. We're also doing more. We're ensuring a sustainable environment for future generations by embracing partnerships and opportunities to do more in our communities. And finally, my most exciting thing is that we have a new Grow, Go Green icon and you can find this throughout the brochure. And um, these are hotels or resorts that are recognized by the Global Sustainable Tourism Council. So if you're trying to vacation more sustainably, just make sure to watch out for that icon. I'm going to get into our sun collection. So basically, we've grouped um, all of our hotels into different categories to help you find the right hotel of your choice. So I'm going to start off with our Lux collection. You can think of this as the creme de la creme. If you really want to spoil yourself, you haven't been out of Alberta or out of Canada for two years now, and you really want to spoil yourself, maybe look for the Lux collection uh, icon right here. It's the brown one with the diamond. Um, it's all about gourmet dining, 24 hour room service, outstanding care and elegant style at deluxe resorts. 
We've also got our boutique collection. So uh, these are deluxe resorts that have no more than 100 rooms. So if you're looking for that small uh, small resort feel with uh, if it's not too crazy, not too busy, uh, definitely look for the boutique collection symbol. The spa collection is pretty self-explanatory. Um, if you're into fitness, yoga, meditation, and you want to go to those resorts that have the latest in spa and gym facilities, you can check out the spa collection symbol. And I'll show you where to find them in a, in a slide coming up here. If you're traveling and you want to go adults only, we've got adults 18 plus and adults 21 plus. For the 21 plus, it'll just change to a 21. Uh, and of course, uh, no kids allowed. So you can enjoy some grown up ideas of a good time. And on the flip side, we also have our family collection. So, of course, these are great for families and people of all ages. Now, within the family collection, we also have a play collection. So the play collection you can think of as kind of an enhanced family collection. So if you are traveling with kids, I would recommend looking for that play collection logo that's right here on the screen. And your play vacation includes kids eat, play and stay for free. So there's great value in that. They've also got dedicated pool areas or sections for kids and a supervised kids club. Our vacation promise has been enhanced since the pandemic. So um, a few things that set us apart from some of our competitors, number one being free first check bag always, okay? Per person and to any destination, you'll get a free checked bag. Now, the reason why I bring that up is that that's enormous value. So if you're comparing us, um, please keep in mind that, you know, a bag per direction is about $50 per person. So right there, it's about $100 savings per person, right? We've also got connecting flights from 54 Canadian airports. So the world is dealing with schedule changes. This is gonna be our reality for the next little while until everything stabilizes and it's everyone. Um, but the good thing is the really good news about Air Canada and Air Canada Vacations is that we can still get you to your destination. So whether you, got, you have to go via Vancouver or via Toronto, which you would have to anyways, if you're coming from Edmonton, um, we can get you there because we have the network of flights and we have the network of the Canadian airports in order to get you to your final destination. We also price match as well. So if you find a lower price or your consultant finds a lower price, um, we'll price match it up to $50 per person. Of course, we covered already your safety first. You can travel with peace of mind with Clean Care Plus covered in one of the first slides here. And new this year, so this one's really exciting. So listen up, uh, refund or change fees. So if your flight does get canceled, you can change your travel plans or you can cancel with a full refund. All right, and Aeroplan points. You can also earn and redeem Aeroplan points when you book a package. So if you're not already a member, it's free to sign up and you get some points. I love my points cards. <laughs> okay, so destination fun facts. In the brochure, you'll find um, some new and exciting destination fun facts. This is due for us this year. I took an example of the Bahamas page and we can't really see that, so let's zoom in. At the bottom, you'll see some of our special insider tips on what to do, what to eat, and what to bring back for each destination, which is kind of fun. In this example, um, it tells you to have some family fun time at the Aqua Venture Water Park. You can have a fish fry at Potter's K, uh, what to eat, conch salad, uh, ceviche style, rum cake, and what to bring back. You can bring jams, jellies, or local spice blends. So this is where I was uh, telling you where the icons will show up. So this is a, an example of a page within our brochure that you'll, you can see online or maybe a physical copy once you pick one up. And these are the, uh, the icons. So as we can see, if we remember from the previous slide, we've got our family collection, Lux collection. This is also part of our spa collection. And this is the Rolton Grenada Resort and Spa. 
All right, and at the bottom of that page, you'll see the AeroPlan members sign, and then you can really look at what this hotel includes. We've also got at a glance, we've got our own ranking system, which is uh, quite a market leader. So, if, you know, if you're a person that really likes a nice pool, a nice fitness area, you're going to want to look for those five dots. If it doesn't have five dots, maybe that's one area, in this case, the beach. It only has four dots, uh, which still means it's a beautiful beach, as you can see from this picture here. Um, so that's a that's a great tool to help help you find the right hotel for you. Now we all want to travel safely, and we all want to travel with flexibility in mind. And so when the pandemic hit, we introduced our CareFlex Plus plan, and uh, we've got great response from it. It's very flexible. If you want to change your booking, you can transfer your package. You can also cancel with a full refund up to 25 days prior to departure, um, but you can cancel with an in-house credit or partial refund between that 24 days and actually all the way up to three days for Mexico and the Caribbean. So it's very flexible um, if you do need to change your travel plans or if you find a nice price online and uh, want to talk to your Expedia Cruises agent and get that booked. Um, and then if you, if the worst happens and you do need to cancel, there is that flexibility. We've also got our carefree. So this includes standard seat selection, year round price drop guarantee and a $50 waiver on administrative change fees. Okay, so let's get into some of the fun stuff. I've selected uh, about seven hotels that I want to share with you. Um, some hotels to watch out for this year, some of my favorites. Um, I'm not going to go through all 550, don't worry, but I'm going to go through um, some of them. The first one I want to talk about is uh, one that I'm really excited about is called Hotel Eshkaret. It's a five-star property. It's located in the beautiful beachfront Mayan Riviera, and it's great for all types of clientele, especially families, but also if you're traveling um, as two adults or a group of adults too. The facilities are quite large, so it's 900 rooms. Uh, with, uh, with that many rooms, of course, you're gonna get lots of options for restaurants and bars. So they've got 11 restaurants, four of those are buffet, seven are a la carte. They've got 14 bars, 11 pools, including an infinity pool and a kid's pool with a water park and a 24 hour fitness and spa. Although I like to say, I don't know who is going to the fitness and spa because there is so much to do at this resort, resort and at the parks and tours. Um, some of the unique features, um, number one, the swimmable rivers throughout the property everyone really loves. Number two, um, guests at this resort get unlimited access and transportation to all the parks and tours that they, that they own. And I'm gonna go through those in a future slide. So let's say that sounds good to you, but you're not traveling with kids. So maybe you can try their sister property. This is Hotel Eshkaret Art. Um, this one opened in July 2021, so it's brand making new. It's located right next door to the other one that I was just talking about. So it's beachfront in the Mayan Riviera. This is, uh, you'd fly into Cancun for that. Um, so it's adults only, 16 plus, so it might be a good option for you if you're not traveling with children. The facilities are almost exactly the same. They have 900 rooms. They have nine restaurants, one of those being a buffet. Eight of those are a la carte. They've got 10 bars, including four rooftop bars, which is amazing. Uh, infinity pools, they've got a beautiful beach, rivers, coves, and an ecological reserve. Again, with the 24-hour fitness and spa. And again, with the unlimited access and transportation to all Grupo Eshkaret parks and tours. And these are the Eshkaret parks and tours that you can go to. Uh, transportation and admission is included uh, with your stay. So there's excellent value if you are that type of person that wants to, uh, you know, really soak in the culture and live, uh, live in the adventure kind of of Mexico, then this might be a great option for you. Like look at all these, Escarapa, Mexico, uh, 50 attractions, Mexican cuisine, Mayan journey, um, there's also the extreme one, which I'm, I'm all about the extreme adventure, kayak ride, off-road vehicle, jet boat ride, uh, the cenotes one. So there's lots of options to do at this resort. I'd like to take a minute to start to talk about the Hilton Playa del Carmen. So this is located of, obviously in Playa del Carmen. Uh, it's an adults only property. 
Um, it's 40 steps from Fifth Avenue. So if you've ever been to Fifth Avenue um, and you want to kind of get the authentic Mexican culture, then this might be a great option for you because it offers the all-inclusive atmosphere, Hilton standards, but you also have the flexibility to just walk to Fifth Avenue if you want to go uh, shopping or get something different to eat. Um, of course, they have beautiful beachfront views. Uh, you can see it in the picture here. And one of the nice things about Playa del Carmen is they have a law where you can't build past, I believe it's the fourth floor. So that's why it's all low rise. So everyone gets a nice view of the ocean. On to the Pacific side. This is one of my favorite hotels in Los Cabos. It's Hyatt Ziva Los Cabos. It's a luxurious oceanfront property. I was able to see this property a couple of years ago before the pandemic, and it blew me away. One of my favorite things was that it has a heated outdoor pool. And uh, this is kind of important for me anyways in Los Cabos because I love to swim and at nighttime it can get a little bit chilly. Um, compared to the rest of Mexico. So that heated outdoor pool was great. Um, they've also got spacious accommodations, uh, magnificent views. They've got, of course, an infinity pool as I put the picture here. And they've also got a kids club and water park. So it's great for families. Okay, on to um, Puerto Vallarta. So Ibera Star Selection Playa Mita. Uh, we sell a lot of this hotel and uh, everyone's very happy with it. The hotel was, is built with 100% regional materials. Um, it's family friendly and they've got their star camp, which is their kids activities program. And one unique thing about this hotel is they're PADI certified. Uh, so they have a scuba center on site. There's also golf available nearby. So if you're a scuba or golf person, this might be a great option for you. Dreams Bahamita Surf Resort and Spa is a beautiful new build. I actually, it's so brand new that I haven't had a chance to see it, but I've uh, done some training on it and I've looked at some pictures and it looks amazing. It's a four and a half star resort. It's 35 minutes from Puerto Vallarta Airport. It's one of our eco-friendly hotels. Um, if, you, if you weren't aware, Dreams, if you ever see Dreams, that means they're always family friendly. So that's a good way to, way to think about it. Their sister property is Secrets, and th that's like the adults-only um, side of the company. So there's Dreams, which is family-friendly, and then Secrets, which is adults-only. And this Secrets is located next door. Um, it's a little bit of a smaller hotel. So typically what we see on the Pacific side is smaller resorts compared to what we see in Cancun. So if you are the type of person that prefers a smaller resort, I might uh, tend to look more towards the Pacific side. This one has 363 all suite rooms, six pools, splash park, eight dining options, six bars. And if you are looking to get married down in uh, Mexico, they've got eight wedding destinations. And eight wedding locations, sorry about that. Um, Bahia Hotels and Resorts. Now, I didn't put a specific one up here. I just wanted to let you know that if you are looking for a good deal this winter, I know that I've seen a lot of good deals for the Bahia Resorts. We have amazing rates uh, with ACV and they've got a wide range of properties. So they offer both family friendly and adults only properties. Um, and these are located throughout the Riviera Maya, Jamaica and Dominican Republic. If you're looking to spoil yourself, we have a promotion with Sandals and Beaches Resorts. So where are Sandals and Beaches? They're mostly in the English Caribbean. Uh, so Grenada, Jamaica, Turks and Caicos, Curacao, um, and until October 31st, so we've got a, about a week and a bit left, uh, you can book your getaway and you can earn 12,000 bonus AeroPlan points per couple if you're an AeroPlan points collector, um, and you can travel all the way up to December 31st, 2022, so uh, just over a year. So let's recap. So when you book your Air Canada Vacations package with your Expedia Cruises travel consultant, um, I just wanted to outline, you get one free checked bag for every package booked. This is about a value of $100 per person. So not every airline um, includes that for you. So that's something to definitely keep in the back of your mind when you're shopping. You can travel safely with Air Canada and Air Canada Vacations. We covered the Clean Care Plus options. 
connectors, we have the capability to get you to your destination so you can go and lay on the beach, which is great this winter. Travel protection, so you can change or cancel your travel plans up to three days prior to departure, offering you more flexibility. Uh, we make it easy for you to find your perfect resort with your consultant. Your consultant takes lots of training sessions. Trust me, I know. And it's so important to have that knowledge when you're booking something, especially when we haven't been away for so long. Um, trends. And I just wanted to briefly touch on the trends. And just to give you a bit of an inside info. Now, Canadians have a bit of a different restriction than Americans. OK, so Americans have been able to travel a little bit more freely than we have. We've had some extra restrictions up here, um, which is fine. But I wanted to let you know that the hotels are not really having an issue with capacity. They're they're projecting very good winters. And although we think that, you know, there should be all these last minute deals and, you know, all these all this availability at the hotels of our choices, my message to you is that if you're ready to travel or if you're ready, if you want something specific, um, it's better to book early than wait until the last minute because, you know, not only have we spent the last two years not traveling, but also all of the Americans have not spent the last two years not traveling. And a lot of people are taking advantage of um, going away this winter. So that's my, that's my only advice is once you're ready and you know everyone's in a different situation, uh, some people are not ready quite yet. Maybe you're thinking about next winter and that's uh, completely fine. But whenever you're ready, um, make sure to, uh, try to try to book as early as you can. All right. And that's actually it. I'm gonna open the floor for some questions. I'll go ahead and turn my video back on now that I am, and I'll pass over the... Thank you so much, Lindsay. It was absolutely fabulous. And like, I wanna pack my bathing suit and get going. So we do have some questions if you'd be kind Thank enough to perfect. answer. Let me just... Uh, okay, so uh, question about AeroPlan points. If I've accumulated AeroPlan points over the last two years from my credit card, can I use them and still book with Expedia Cruises? Um, yes, you can still book with Expedia Cruises, um, but Lisa, I might take that one on, offline with you. Okay. <laughs> All right, we'll get back to it's a bit, it's just uh, a little bit do, com more complicated. <laughs> okay. All right, perfect. Do the resorts offer free COVID testing, uh, PCR testing for Canadians coming home, or if it's not free, is there an approximate cost? And how easy is it to get? Yeah, you know what? That's a really good question, and it depends on the hotel. I know that some of our hotel partners are offering free COVID tests. Um, I haven't got a list, unfortunately. Um, other ones are offering it for really cheap. So, I mean, it depends on where you go. Some destinations, like take Los Cabos, for example, it can be a lot more expensive than Cancun. And I know for a fact it is. Um, I don't know the rhyme or reason for it, um, but I know that it is more expensive than other destinations. So that's definitely something to look into um, before you book your trip so that you're well aware of the costs. Okay. And now do you also offer any travel insurance with your packages that would cover COVID risks such as medical or quarantining? So, co uh, so COVID insurance, uh, no, we don't offer the COVID insurance, but you can add it onto the package. What we recommend, we used to use um, Allianz. And so you can add that onto the package, or if you have another favorite of choice, I think, you know, they're getting a lot more reasonable in price, you know, when the pandemic yeah. first it, no one knew what was going on and it was hundreds and hundreds of dollars if you could even get it and now when you're going away for a seven week ho seven day holiday i should say i wish we could go away for seven weeks uh but seven day holiday runs you 50 bucks you know so it's, it's becoming a lot more affordable okay and and manulife as well we yeah. we basically use manulife and they have uh, insurance uh seaweed issues in the mayan riviera is that still an issue? Are there areas or times of year to avoid? Um, it, I'm going to tell you, and you know, your Expedia consultants will tell you that I'm very transparent. Seaweed will always be an issue, and it's really tough to 
Uh, yes, because it depends on, uh, I'm not, I know I'm not using the right terminology, but it depends on the flow of the ocean because what happens is the waves pick up all of the seaweed and then put it onto the beach. Now, a lot of hotels are um, really active in cleaning all of that seaweed up. And sometimes you, you can't avoid it, you know, and sometimes I've seen hotels, they put those barriers out in front of the, or like in the middle, not in the middle of the ocean, but far out a little bit to try to protect against the seaweed, but it's still, it still might happen. So it's, it's really hard for me to say, you know, this resort's fine, this resort's not, because I don't want to, I don't want you to be disappointed uh, if, if seaweed's something that uh, really matters to you. I know that, um, from what I understand, and the consultants keep, keep me honest here, but Cuba, Kayakoko, uh, I have never heard of an issue in Kayakoko uh, for the seaweed issue. Um, but as for the Cancun Riviera Maya, it is, it is, a, it is a risk. Okay. I, I did notice that you don't have any direct flights, as you said, from Edmonton. Uh, will, that, will that come back next year so that we don't have to connect somewhere else? Fingers crossed. <laughs> Fingers, Fingers crossed. crossed. <laughs> okay. All right. I mean, I think I think what's happened, not just with Air Canada vacations, but with many airlines, just because of COVID, lots of routings got diminished and changed. All right. Yeah. Uh, question about can Air Canada vacations take me to Hawaii this year? Yes, we can. <laughs> okay. All right. Yay. 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 <laughs> uh -huh. Yay. All right. I think that is all the questions that we had. You know, thank you for giving us such a wonderful um, presentation and highlighting some of those beautiful resorts. It really makes us feel, yes, it's, it's somewhere that I definitely want to go. So tonight's presentation was on land vacations. Don't forget, everybody, that we also sell cruises. And Lindsay made a very valid point in terms of the land vacations. Unfortunately, we're not going to see last minute deals happening this year or even next year just because of the demand for travel. Everybody wants to get away. We've missed two years. So whether it's your land vacation or cruises, we're booking into 2022, 2023, and even 2024. So uh, definitely if you're thinking of traveling, it's time to plan. So I want to thank you, everybody, for joining us. We appreciate your time. We appreciate your travels, your past travels with us. We look forward to your future travel. Re reach out to your consultant if you have any questions or want us to help you start planning your next vacation. And Randy has put in here, we've got some uh, updating or upcoming uh, events happening. Reminder to watch us on Facebook. Each of the locations has their own Facebook as well as their YouTube channels where all of our presentations are um, posted so you can watch any of the recordings. Next week, we're going to be dealing with Avalon Waterways featuring Europe exotics, including the Mekong. So please join us if you can. Thank you so much for your time. Winter is coming. It's time to take out your passports and your carry on bag, dust them off, and let's start planning a vacation. So thanks, everyone. Thank you, everyone. Thank Good you. Night. Thanks, Randy. Thanks, Gwen. Thanks, Lorraine.